Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, my name is Eva and it would mean so much to me if you hit that subscribe button down below, like the video obviously if you like this sort of content and just continue watching. So today I'm going to talk about a little bit controversial topic and that is Botox. And I more want to look at it from the angle, what am I currently doing to postpone the Botox as much as I can. Now, I've always liked really, really natural look, but obviously with coming um, years, <laughs> the natural look is obviously, you know, not as what it used to be. Now, I've got a few kind of lines, um, especially on my forehead, that have been bothering me, especially, you know, they are really visible in a harsh light, very dull light, which we get in England so much. And I think that these lines got much, much worse after I had my baby Liam just because purely lack of sleep and the kind of lifestyle changes. Obviously the baby, having a baby takes a lot out of you, a lot of nutrition and, and all these things I believe are connected. But I want to talk about like the basic things I think may help in order to avoid Botox or postpone it as much as I can. In an ideal world I would like to wait at least next five years uh, but I don't know. So I've had uh, conversations with some of my friends. Some of them say definitely you don't need it. There were maybe one or two that said yeah go for it. But obviously when you have a Botox too early it looks amazing when you have it done just like that. It looks quite natural obviously people can probably tell you had Botox and I've seen a lot of influencers having that done obviously looking amazing on their videos on their pictures however the question is are they gonna look like that in 20 years because with Botox I've heard once you start you can't kind of stop the number one thing I would say is very important is to look after yourself in terms of what you actually put in your body so it is drinking a lot of water perhaps some cleanse teas and really think about the overall health what we eat what we drink and um, I've actually filmed full video about how I stay healthy which I can link down below and hopefully um, on the screen as well so you can see the link and talk about the basics but in general I would say a lot of water and nutritious food. When it comes to number two, I've actually added a couple of things into my routine. The first thing is actually this powder, which is a collagen powder. This is by Omonocare and it comes in this box. Now, I've actually included this in a number of videos previously in my health video but also unboxing video when the brand actually sent me to test this. I've been using this now regularly for the last two months. I definitely see difference. Um, it is very very simple to use. Um, I tend to drink this in the morning. I just put it in the glass of water but you can simply add it in your juice. Just stir it. It tastes nicely. I mean it's not something <laughs> you know it's not like a milkshake or anything like that but it tastes quite milky and I um and I've heard a lot of people were really happy now Omono this specific product has got really good reviews uh, some beauty editors from a well-known magazines online and printed magazines and I've been very very happy with it I can see uh, the first results in terms of the elasticity has definitely improved the skin definitely seems firmer obviously you can't um, rely on it in terms of like having the same results as Botox but you can definitely see progress and that's what you're looking for obviously nothing will probably deliver the same res results as Botox however you know it's all about the small steps while still looking really naturally so this is definitely a big yes from me I still have got I think another box so I'm gonna continue using this as well and this is good um, of course for other things um, I like your nails and hair and um, so you can't really go wrong with this product so definitely thumbs up step number three is definitely for me what has worked for me and what I'm continuously doing now is dermal rolling um, so obviously you can have um, dermal rolling done in this uh, in the salon which is obviously much harsher um, I've never done it, but I'm using a home uh, dermal roller again, which I mentioned on my blog and on my social media previously. So this one um, is by Swiss Clinique. Again, I'm going to link it down below. And I think you probably may have seen in my previous videos, but it looks like this. And 
you've got this little bit with a small micro needles. Now this one I have got size 0.5 milliliters, so slightly larger than the ones I spoke about last time, but I thought when the 0.2 work for me quite well and you know I'm not bleeding or any kind of major reaction, I'm going to use definitely the deeper one. So I've included this in my skincare routine. I'm trying to do it every other day and then maybe stop for a week. Uh, but every beautician and every specialist who I ask, do you think I need Botox, they said stick to Derma Rolling for now because it long term really can help you to avoid Botox for much, much longer. So the way it works, it basically creates um, with the micro needles, it kind of breaks your skin. So if you apply this and roll it up and down on your affected areas, it obviously breaks the skin and it forces the skin to renew, which is ultimately what we need because that is what is going to kind of create a new layer of the skin. And that means the old skin is obviously, or you know, the top layer is going to shed down. So if you have got things like even pigmentation, acne scars, not just wrinkles, this is a brilliant product. Obviously it works the best when you use a product after it that helps to renew um, the skin and also boost collagen. And by breaking your skin, you also allow the skin to soak so much more of the product and all the goodness you would have in the product than you would normally have without this. So it definitely has got a lot of benefit. I'm gonna keep continue, uh, continuing to use this um, um, long term, I would say, because I've been very happy with it and um, it's very, very easy to use and it doesn't even take a long time. The next thing I want to talk about is definitely using the right products for you. So with all these combined things, uh, you know, it is all about, you know, looking after your skin as well. So it's about obviously, you know, taking your makeup off at night and then applying the right products that are targeted for your issues. And as you probably know, I'm a huge skincare lover. So I've got loads of things to talk about. Now you can maybe um, have a look at some of my skincare um, routine videos previously where you get an idea what sort of brands I like and use and my skincare routine changes every time and I like to try new things but um, as I would mention in combination maybe with the derma roller I like to use things like extra so I'm a huge fan of facial masks this is actually currently one of my favorites this mask by Guerlain, it's from the Abel Royal um, set or range and it's absolutely amazing. It's uh, basically repairing honey gel mask and it is definitely one of my favorite. And exactly on the days when I'm tired, this works magic because then when you apply the makeup on, the skin definitely looks much just healthier, juicier and just more plump. And I almost feel like it's got instant effect on the fine lines, especially, you know, the forehead lines. I've definitely tried it on my worst days when I didn't sleep and then I traveled and, you know, I didn't get time to sleep and I just had to go through the day when I traveled to Florence and I felt like it did really help me a lot. And, you know, there's a lot of things like overnight masks and... Uh, things like aging masks you can use but um, that would be probably <laughs> for another video it is just about like you finding the right skincare that would suit you the next thing I want to talk about is definitely using vitamins and giving your body uh, something extra something you probably not want to get from your uh, general diet and obviously even though you're trying to eat as healthy as possible sometimes you know when we're in a rush you know we stop eating healthily and the safe option is obviously use vitamins now I'm absolutely keen on these two sets of vitamins that has been specifically designed and tailored to me based on my DNA. So even my DNA test showed uh, that, you know, when it comes to antioxidants, my level is quite fine uh, naturally, but elasticity, not that great. So basically this one is targeted for elasticity. Uh, so it contains things like folic acid, um, uh, collagen, biotin and other things. And this one is just generally for skin and hair, so vitamin B6, 
pantothenic acid, biotene, millet or copper. But obviously I would use um, general vitamins as well, which you can get in the shop. I think in general things like zinc and things like that are very, very good for your skin. And it is all about basically what you put inside. Obviously, again, it doesn't mean it's going to deliver the same results as Botox. But for people like me that are keen to postpone it as much as they can, you have to do whatever, whatever it takes. Another thing I would definitely say would be, um, you know, go to regular facials because um, obviously, you know, it's going to really boost the circulations. If a professional would do the massage for you, it's a nice treat. It's about obviously relaxing your body as well. And I believe that goes hand in hand with everything we do and, and fighting aging as well. If you're going to do something regularly like exercise, obviously it will deliver the result. So if you're going to go and have facial done, again it will only help um, when it comes to kind of aging and fighting aging and obviously I can't forget the most important thing and that is sleep as much as you can now this is probably where I'm failing the most I'm trying to sleep I'm now started to go to bed much early I trust me during the week I'm in bed as early as eight just because having a toddler like Liam that is wild and runs around and still wakes up at nine is not easy so I've been pretty much going with really lack of sleep even during pregnancy because I naturally used to wake up it's almost like the body was preparing so I would say a good two years I haven't slept properly and it's almost like you're set on a different body clock you know it's not your body clock when you wake up it's your child's body clock so if your child decides at 4 a.m they're done with sleeping unfortunately but it is what it is and that's what you have to do and and um, actually one of my friends uh, Teresa she mentioned she's noticed that a lot of her friends that had kids they look for a while much older than they actually were just I purely think the sleep is one of the most important things and obviously if they were not getting sleep you know it was showing on their skin and how they looked and the whole Kind of overall appearance and then when the kids were older and started to sleep more obviously the skin went back to normal because obviously sleep is the best um thing you can actually do for your skin and your overall being and um, unfortunately you know it's not in my control at the moment but that would be definitely one of the key things i wanted to mention And the last thing I wanted to mention is something I'm not practicing at the moment but I'm seriously thinking about it is to get one of those facial massages you can use uh, just simply any sort of circulation and forcing your um, blood to circulate more and um, obviously in these areas and on your face is definitely helpful because um, it just brings a bit of life. <laughs> I'm not gonna go into details and obviously medical details, but massages in general and circulations always bring the best. Um, and I thought because obviously I can't do it manually and I don't have time to do it manually, it would be great to use um, you know, a specific product that would help me to massage the skin and make sure obviously the products I'm using are gonna be absorbed much better. Um, and I've heard again from other influencers it delivers really 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 good results so perhaps that is something for me to look into and um, you know just get one of the products and really test it out if that if that works again long term so guys that's it from me today if you have got any other tips or you think I should have included something else let me know in the comments below and um, also let me know if you like these sort of videos um, you know I was quite keen to talk about it um, just purely because it has been on my mind a lot and I've been trying to kind of include all the kind of small things and changes in my diet and in my routine. So it would be great to know from your perspective. Thank you very much for watching. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button and you know what to do. Like the video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!